What's going on boys? Queen69 here. Hey guys, I'm Piran here. Just a quick video where I'll go over how I roll my maps. Uh, before I was just putting two rows here, rolling them, running them and repeat, but um, if you roll them in your stash you can take advantage of the search function, which is pretty cool. Um, so first of all you get rid of the unidentified ones, we don't have any right now. Then you scour the magic ones, and then you start chiseling them. But first, you put the rare ones away so you don't accidentally chisel these while they are rare. So we search for quality, and we start painting Bob Ross style. We just have to sort of make a decision where we want the little stream to come from. Maybe back in here. And I know this is going to look like we're destroying everything. Don't worry about it. We don't make mistakes. We have happy accidents. So once we're done with this, we're going to check out which one of them has reflect, elemental reflect. Oh, I'm sorry. First, we have to bulk them. My bad. So we're painting again. But this time we're painting them yellow. Okay, so now we're gonna check for reflect. So these four have reflect, which means this one's physical, so that's fine. This one's physical, this one's physical, this one's elemental. So we scour this one and roll it again. <coughs> no reflect. Now we're gonna check for leech. There is none, so we're happy about that. And so this is this is uh, my character, which cannot run elemental reflect and cannot leech maps. Of course, you replace these um, these mods with mods that your character can run. So if you can't run physical reflect, then you just go reflect, and then you reroll the physical ones, and so on. So now we've checked for all the mods that we cannot run. So now we're gonna check for pack size. So we can see that these gray ones don't have pack size. So if they don't have good numbers, which this doesn't, this doesn't, this doesn't, and so on, we're gonna scour all those and reroll them to have pack size. So let's do that. We go rare again, and at this point I don't do this. I, at this point I just look at them individually. Okay, this one's ended up being reflect, so that's not good. That's good. It's also good. And I just roll them one by one. Or if there is like way too many that ended up being uh, no pack size or or nothing good, then yeah, you just roll all of them and you repeat the process. So we go reflect again. Uh, this one I think ended up being elemental reflect here. Yeah, this one, and that's it. So we should be done. Right about now. Physical reflect. No pack size though. So we're gonna roll this last one until we're happy with it. 30% pack size. So now we should have a full stash tab of maps that we are all happy with, and it doesn't include elemental reflect, it doesn't include leech. And they all have pack size, except this one. Let's fix it. Tap change. Perfect. So now you have a almost full stash tab, half stash tab of maps that you're all happy to run, and you don't you won't, you won't have to look at affixes again. You just fill them into your bags and blast them. So you can use the ancient crane technique, which I learned from General, to make sure that your maps end up on the right side of your inventory. That way, if you if you run them on the left side, then the new maps you find will go in the middle of them and confuse you. This way you can keep all of them on the right side and your loot will go to the left. So uh, yeah, uh, this is obviously not my idea. I'm sure other people are doing this. I just wanted to make this quick video to... Um, 
maybe it's helpful for some people. Thank you for watching and uh, see you on stream or in the next video.